Introducing the magic of brick tiles from South Africa. Brick tile magic tiles are cut from solid clay bricks produced by South Africa's clays to a thickness of 9, 18 and 32 mm. Our tiles are made from actual clay bricks and their colors is permanently baked into the bricks. BTM tiles are completely weatherproof when applied correctly and covers a larger surface area than extruded tiles. Our tiles are versatile and can easily be used for exterior or interior finishes. BTM brick tiles can be applied to almost any solid surface. Mitering, cutting and shaping our tiles are easily achieved with a baby angle grinder fitted with a masonry blade. These tiles are easy to handle and apply. Just follow these 10 easy steps for complete peace of mind. Step 1. The tools you will require are as follows. A chipping hammer, a clear water pipe or level, a chalk line, a pallet knife, pointing tools and a bucket. The wall should be cleared and free of grease. If painted, small chips on the wall will ensure that you bond the tiles onto the plaster. Brush the wall to remove the flaky bits. Surface preparation should always be strictly observed as the success of the application is directly related to the preparation undertaken. If applied properly, BTM brick tiles will form a homogeneous bond with the surface to become one with the structure. Step 2. If the surface is flaky, soft and has rising damp, it is advisable to use a base coat or a good brand of bonding liquid. This is to stabilize the condition of the wall before you commence tiling. The base coat is prepared to mix one part of the bonding liquid with one part water and two parts of cement powder. This is then applied with a big brush and left to dry. Step 3. Using a water dumpy level, find a mean level line on either side of the wall to be tiled. A good starting point is the top of the doors or windows as these all have lintels above them. Step 4. Using a chalk line to set out horizontal guidelines for the placing of your tiles. This is achieved by measuring the width of your tile and adding 10 to 12 millimeters for the grouting gap. The guidelines must be placed for every course of the tiles from the top to the bottom. Step 5. Prepare your adhesive according to the manufacturer's directions. Beware not to add excess water as this will result in the tile slipping once you have placed the tile on the wall. Important: Do not mix more adhesive than you can use in one hour. Step 6. Remember, always mix a number of boxes before you commence tiling. Do not take two tiles directly after one another from the same box. Doing this will give you an uneven spread of color and general tone to your application. Using a serrated applicator, apply tile adhesive to the full length of the tile. The tile must be placed on the wall just under the guideline. Apply pressure to the tile and slide the tile up to meet the chalk guideline. When you release your hand, the tile should not move. If it begins to slide, you have mixed too much water with your adhesive. The chalk guideline should always be at the top of the brick tiles and not the bottom.
When tiling onto cement, concrete and mortar surfaces, you should use cement-based ceramic tile adhesive for best result. However, should you want to apply Brick Tile Magic Brick Tiles onto fiberboard, timber or any other flexible surfaces, you should use an appropriate flexible adhesive. This is to compensate for the movement and different coefficient of expansion and contraction of the different materials. Step 7. Grouting is achieved by mixing fine plaster sand and cement powder in a 3 to 1 mix ratio. Not too wet and not too dry. Special care must be taken not to mess the grout onto the tiles themselves as cleaning is very very difficult. The grout mix is placed into the space using a grouting pallet tool. Steps 8 and 9. Using a rounder or a square pointing tool, point the grout that you have placed between the tiles and then cut off the excess grout with a pallet knife. Continue until all grouting is complete. Should you choose not to grout, use a wet paint brush to smooth the excess adhesive in the areas between the tiles to give a recessed grouting effect. Step 10. After about 30 minutes from completing the application, use a blot brush to brush down the whole application to remove excess grout and dust. You now will have peace of mind. Remember, bonding liquids can be added to the adhesive and grouting to enhance bonding and weathering properties. Why Brick Tile Magic Brick Tiles? Brick Tiles increase the value of your home instantly. Brick tiles are the most cost effective way to a beautiful home. Brick tiles are quick and easy to apply. Brick tiles are maintenance free, no more paint ever. Brick tiles are durable, won't show dirt, cracks or damp. For more details contact BTM Brick Tiles on 084-912-9245 or 082-709-2022. Or visit our website at www.bricktilemagic.co.za Thank you for using BTM to beautify your home.